Hi, my name is Andras Banet and I'm senior partner at Online EU Training. Today I'm going to speak about the EPSO Assessment Center, more specifically the structured interview and even more specifically the introduction at the beginning of your interview. Many people that I train or attend my coaching sessions ask me regularly, what am I supposed to say in that introduction? And is it true that it's supposed to be two or three minutes? It seems quite long. The answer is quite simple. Keep it short, keep it simple. What I mean by this is even if you are supposed to have two to three minutes in that introduction, I suggest to keep it at roughly one minute. You don't want to be interrupted in the middle of your introduction. You don't want to be cut by the assessors because they may be a bit behind schedule. Because the main thing here is that it's not scored. It doesn't belong in the assessment matrix. They are not going to give you an evaluation based on your introduction. However, it's very important that you establish good chemistry, a good atmosphere, and you really talk about something, talk about your background in a way that will trigger a positive atmosphere in the room with the assessors. So what you say in that roughly one minute is even secondary to how you say it and how you wrap your message. Nevertheless, regarding the content of your, of your little expose, you can certainly talk about your academic achievements, you can talk about some work experience if you have any, and you can certainly mention your motivation or your interest in working for European institutions. At the same time, you may do something that may be less obvious, nevertheless useful. For instance, if you happen to speak in a very low voice, or you happen to speak extremely fast, you may highlight this already in the introduction, sort of preempting a negative assessment and saying, this is something, the way I speak, and I'm trying to improve that, and already mention that, even before the assessors may judge you negatively on your communication skills or the way you present a certain information. This is Andras Banet, and I hope to see you on online EU training and wish you good luck for the exam.